Hey, it's Midnight Raven. You can't see me, but I'm going to be bringing you my Christmas decorations. Um, they're very minimalistic. We don't do a huge amount of decorating for Christmas, but I thought I would just share with you my decorations. So our first decoration is our Christmas banner, and it just says Merry Christmas. Um, we used to, uh, to do a lot of decorating, but the fact that we're in a bungalow now, we tend not to. Then if we go towards the window, we have a stocking, and then we have another stocking. If we come closer this way, we then have my son's paper chain, which we spent absolutely hours on, and it's all well cool, all the way around. Um, the medals you can see, a little extra, are my son's go-karting medals. And he's just got a gold last week in his go-karting, so I'm, that's really good. But back to the Christmas decorations. We then have cards over there, just a few. We don't have many cards at the minute. Then we have our Christmas candle holder and my big Christmas candle, um, which um, will um, be used near at Christmas. Then we have the Christmas rules, which are very important, which says, eat, drink, be merry, sing carols, be nice, not naughty, spend time with family, no peeking, and do not open presents until uh, presents before the 25th. And this is my son's elf chart, which he's doing really well on. It's a couple of tens and eights. Um, I'm not really into the whole elf thing, but I thought the elf behavior chart was kind of a good idea. Um, and then he's got his little elf box up there that Santa brings a little letter every day telling him how well he's behaved. And then we have um, the Christmas tree, which is actually quite big. And for the first time ever, we've got a real Christmas tree. So we've got our table down the bottom where all the needles keep falling off. And then we have our tree, which is actually quite big. Doesn't quite fit in the camera. So this is the first time we've had a real tree. Um, and on the tree, we have our star at the top, which might change to a bow at the weekend that I'm trying to get hold of. Then we have my son's special one that he bought um, his dad. That whoop, strobe warning. And it kind of lights up. These ones I bought are new. They're like cushiony ones. They're right, like, well, cool. There's a couple on the tree. We have some red and gold baubles. We have my icicles, which are really cool. And we have these gorgeous glitter baubles. We have silver, um, we have gold, and we have red. I'm so used to having silver on my tree. We have the special little one that my son made years and years ago that we still have on my tree. We have red and gold tinsel. Then we have disco kind of looking baubles here with the glitter again. We have Mr. Snowman, which is made out of tinsel. Um, down the bottom, we have these gorgeous bells that I found. And then we have a different set of icicles in red. We have my snowflakes, which are kind of cool. Then we have different cushiony ones, all in different shapes. There's a Christmas tree around here somewhere. Oh, here is my Christmas hat on the tree, which is, looks really cool. Then at the top, we have this really gorgeous bauble as well that I found at the charity shop. Then we just have the normal kind of plain gold and red baubles. Um, then inside there are tiny little presents hidden. These are just little fake, whoop, little fake presents, but they're kind of cute as well. So we have a couple of them. Um, and I think that's about it. We don't do a huge, like I said, a huge amount of decorating on the tree. Um, we don't like it to be overbearing. And then the bottom of the tree is the basket I bought from um, my hills. And then inside it's got the bucket because obviously you've got water it every day, which I've never had to do with a fake tree. Last year we had a fake white tree with blue and silver decorations, if I remember rightly. Uh, but I have always wanted a black tree. Um, never got one. 
maybe one year. So that is our Christmas decorations. They are very minimalistic, as I said, um, but I thought I would share them with you. I'm hoping to get a reef as well for the door, um, but I haven't quite got that yet. So I will give you another couple of second footage of my tree. And then I will bring you the next Christmas video will be my video of the neighborhood um, lights as well as the charity lights that are at the bottom of my road. So I will bring you a case of the lights that are around. Oh, we'll do one more thing. We'll turn on the lights and see if you can see them. We have one set of lights on our tree. I do not know if they will show up. Can you see them? There's like the odd light. I don't know how well you will see them in the daytime. But there, as you can see, are just some coloured lights on there. Like I said, again, very minimalistic lights. We don't like uh, a huge amount of lights on the tree. And we don't like to like flood the tree with too much. So, like I said, I'm going to bring you the charity lights in the next couple of days. Um, from the village because they have a charity one which is this month is this year is for the lifeboat charity so I will bring you them hopefully over the weekend so if you haven't already I'd love if you'd like and subscribe to my channel thank you to everyone that's been subscribing and I will see you very soon for another video if I know you don't see you before then anyone who doesn't watch my videos between now and Christmas have a nice Christmas be nice to each other and don't drink too much. And I'll see you very soon for another video. Thanks for watching. Merry Christmas. Bye.